You might have noticed a difference in the signal. The signal level dropped, but the signal to noise ratio increased. That was a difference between feeding the antenna as an end fed against the ground and feeding it as a dipole. Not as good for a transmit antenna, but better as a receive antenna. Yeah, nothing was going that way. 
the, the other two stations are both currently operating on 40 metres air level. I can't give you a frequency, but they are there. We have the three actual stations, separate stations operating, and uh, uh, they're divided into you know, like three rooms, so we're not having any. There's no issues. It's uh, incredible, really, when you think about it, the way it's set up. It's, uh, the boy has done a great job up here. Just a pity it couldn't stay as a, a working amateur radio station, mate. But anyway, uh, we need a, a need a, a need a millionaire to, to buy it all, mate. Yeah, could you, if you, could you could you sell a few sheep down there, mate? Sell a few sheep and take over up here, over. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, I'm going to Ballarat tomorrow <laughs> with some. <laughs> Yeah, uh, what uh, uh, what uh, antenna are you using now, uh, Greg? Uh, uh, like I say, I, I'm going to see if I can uh, walk into that big 496 vertical a uh, <laughs> uh, short distance away. Is uh, uh, what, what antenna are you using at the moment? Are you using a rhombic or a server curtain or, uh, or what? Yeah, currently we're running on the rhombic, which is called the PX1 there, uh, for, uh, Neville, uh, on the rhombic. Uh, I'm looking at a chart here. It's only, uh, it's very narrow, um, and it's banging sort of over, well, it looks like from the heading here that it's right into a, well, it hits the bottom of the Illusion Islands. That's where the center of it is, and then it's, uh, 20 degrees either side of that, so uh, don't quote me, mate. I might be reading it wrong. But it is the wrong mate. It's the big one, over. Oh, beauty. No wonder you're so loud. Why, uh, I don't know what's going on here with it. I had a heap of noise sort of come up, and then it disappeared off the... the Roger, thanks for that information. I usually don't get any noise, but I don't know why. Yeah, but, uh, oh, great. Yeah, so, uh, all right. Uh, yeah, pro yeah, I was listening for, I heard him on 40, uh, about 7180, yeah, 7180, uh, Greg. Uh, but, uh, well, well, they could be, are they on, uh, 82, are they on 82, do you know, bro? Uh, I don't think anyone's working on, on 80 presently there, uh, Neville. No, I don't think so. I think both the other two stations are both currently working on 40. And, uh, yeah, a station just broke in. It's centered on, uh, San Francisco, I think. Yeah. Dick. Go ahead, that other station. Uh, yeah, Roger Dallas, and it is, this rhombic is centered on San Francisco, Roger. Yeah, the bearing, uh, the bearing is 65 degrees, but you have to remember that the antenna was designed for higher frequency, and that radiation pattern was uh, probably for about five minutes after. So because you're on 150 meter, there'll be low or off the uh, off the rubbish in all sorts of directions. So it's a bit of a bad thing. Yeah, Roger there. Uh, uh, yeah, oh God, yeah, Rick, Rick's come in before and he mentioned something about unknown quantities with it. But uh, yeah, it's it's a good hunk of wire anyway. <laughs> yeah, so that's the case there, Neville. Did you copy that other station? Uh, uh, EB, in, uh, he's in Shepherd and operating from the club rooms. Yeah, Roger, uh, Greg, yeah. Oh, no, that's, uh, that's interesting, yeah. So, yeah, I can remember uh, uh, that many years ago, uh, uh, listening to Radio Australia coming from there, no doubt, uh, when I was over in WVN, uh, just using a, uh, oh, I think it was about a nine transistor radio, just to pound it. <laughs> you know, you could listen at the appropriate time, and I just can't quite remember what the frequencies were now that it's uh, that long ago. But uh, anyway, I guess I better let you work uh, some other states there. How long are you up there for, uh, Greg? Uh, if, we can, if we can go the distance, mate, if we can get into the 15th round at midnight, we'll be right, over. <laughs> right, uh, beauty. Yeah, have you caught up with uh, three I.O. yet? Uh, he should be about the bed. No, no, I can't say we have. We, we, we've worked nearly your oh, 20 stations here on 160, so... <laughs> yeah, I've worked up your land uh, off the same antenna back, uh, uh, back there in the wintertime. Uh, VI3 uh, Radio Australia. 
Christmas uh, VK3 uh, South Rex way at the mic. Uh, VK3 is here, Fox. <laughs> Good on you, Neville, and don't forget BK3 PAH here on the, on the pencil, mate. Uh, so, all the best and uh, have a great time. VI3 Radio Australia, VK3 ZF. Uh, Good night, Captain. Yeah, Roger, Roger, Neville. Yeah, some very, very interesting, oh, well, the antenna systems, mate. Uh, you, you, you know, it's, uh, it's something to die for to have this in your back, baby. Yeah, VK3HJ, uh, VI3 Radio Australia, go ahead, name is Greg. Yeah, g'day Greg, you've got Luke this end, uh, 5 9 plus 40, 100 watts in a, uh, a dipole here, just the uh, dipole I put up the other day, a uh, bit on that one for the local stations, located at Ben Lock, near Lansfield in central Victoria, and uh, Luke, you've got a uh, Sunshine Coast Radio Australia just in the other end, just the dipole I put up the other day, a bit on that one for the local stations, located at Ben Lock, near Lansfield in central Victoria, so not far away, VI3RA, VK3HJ. Yeah, Roger there, Luke. I think I heard you talking about that antenna the other day, mate, so <laughs> it's working. 100 watts doing a great job. I think uh, we've got 100 watts, but I think we've got uh, a lot more wire, mate. Uh, you're around 40 over, so great signal uh, there, um, Luke. It's really good. OK, mate, we'll throw it back to you. Uh, we've got Peter here on the, on the pencil, and um, as I said, we're on the mic, and... Uh, We've had a well, quite a number, of, large number of contacts here on 160. It's uh, livened things up a bit, mate. Like uh, maybe like the old days. I can remember uh, maybe a yeah, long time ago, back in AM days. There used to be a lot of activity on 160. Anyway, the VK3HJ, uh, the uh, VI. Now I'm getting confused. The VI3 Radio Australia. Yeah, yeah, I'll. Uh, I'll uh, yeah, I keep it short. There's uh, other stations calling, but um, uh, two points. Uh, there, there, there. Um, if anyone's um, keen to do some CW, there's a 160 metre contest. Uh, probably goes until 15 Zulu. The Stu Perry test. Uh, unfortunately, with uh, 160 metre contests, um, <laughs> they, they seem to be busy working all the. All strong stations and tend to over, overlook the uh, the DX. Uh, there's a very strong station coming in from Hungary this morning on 160. Uh, he, he was about a strength 8 here, but <laughs> I gave her everything I had, but uh, just caught, kept on calling CQ so, and working other European stations. And uh, do you have anyone on, uh, on CW there uh, tonight, Peter, over? That's uh, Greg, Greg, over. Greg just stuck the white one. Please, this is Peter. Uh, there. Uh, yeah, okay, we're, uh, uh, Luke, yeah, I wrote Lucknow, I was on the pen, I was getting a bit tired, I think. <laughs> VK3, HJ, this is VI3, RA. Oh, right, it's a, it's a major one, isn't it? Yeah, it's a to get up here, but uh, once in a lifetime, it never happened again there, mate, so we thought we'd better make sure we yeah, come part of it, you know, and, uh, yeah, so, uh, so we, we'll be here about midnight, we'll close the station down, but we'll uh, stay in light, because they turn around and drive home there, uh, uh, Luke, over. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure, and uh, no, you wouldn't want five hours uh, <laughs> drive up to a full day on top of five hours drive up there, uh, Peter. Uh, is there anyone on CW there tonight, Peter Over? No, not at the moment. I don't think there, there were some going uh, this afternoon, but no one out there at the moment. They're just on 40 metres on voice at the moment, are they? Oh, OK, no worries. OK, well, there's other stations calling, so uh, I won't hog, hog the, um, uh, the, the limelight here. Nice to make the contact with you, Peter, and also to Greg. Uh, g'day to everyone else up there, and uh, enjoy the rest of the, uh, the activation. Oh, and uh, Peter... Uh, Uh, Barry Lansfield. Uh, 
QRZ, this is VI3, Radio Australia, listening. Uh, Victor Kilo 3 Alpha Papa. VK 3 Alpha Papa. Yeah, okay, we've got a few stations there, but we've got. Uh, I think it was a VK3 Sierra India Mike. Sierra India Mike, yeah, VK3 Sierra SIM. Over. Yeah, we're well, well, uh, um, I think someone else was saying that the noise was at the moment. Uh, it's a Okay, Don. Yeah, don't worry, sir. Yeah, uh, BK3. Yeah, you're just right there. I've got the copy of the guy going here. As I am. <laughs> uh, BI3. All right. Name this way is clear. I'm going to take a, take a radio. Hey, Greg, there's a slow right here beside me. Uh, it's just a scribble, so I can't read what he's writing there, Don, but uh, uh, the special station up here of the uh, Radio Australia uh, closed down the ceremony, shall we say, uh, over. Uh, I'll give you a signal strength 5-9 plus, uh, what was the QDH, over? I thought it was QDH in South Moraine, uh, 25 kilometres north east of the Melbourne City near back. Don't worry, it's a couple of hours there today, on the way up here, mate. <laughs> uh, okay, Don, yeah, no worries, alright, we'll catch you later, man. Okay, QRZ, this is Radio Australia, 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 Radio VK3 Alpha Papa. Uh, roger, roger. VK3 Alpha Papa. Thanks very much. Uh, great signal uh, into uh, into Melbourne at the moment. I'm uh, normally up in Rutherglen, uh, <laughs> but uh, I'm in Melbourne at the moment. So uh, yeah, very good signal. You're you're about a five and nine. It, it is a little bit of QSB there, uh, but uh, but all, all quite readable. Name is a CO Tango Hotel Echo Oscar. CO over. VI3 uh, Radio Australia. VK3 Alpha Papa. Thanks, Theo. QRZ, this is VI3, Radio Australia. VK3, Fox Zulu. VK3, Fox Zulu, I think I got the calls right. Is that it? This is VI3, Radio Australia. Roger, what was the name over? Roger. Roger, Roger, mate, okay, in the background here. <laughs> QRZ, this is Victor India 3, Radio Australia. Victor India 3, Radio Australia, special mid station. Now listening. Uh, VI3 RA, VI3 RA calling CQ on 160. CQ on 160 metres. Victor India 3, Radio Australia calling CQ 160, CQ 160, VI 3, RA calling CQ and listening. Alright, VK 3EB in Kebbin. Must be a stone throw away because you're spinning the needle. <laughs> Good on you there. Uh, I can't remember the name. I've lost it. But anyway, yeah, I remember, remember talking to you. Uh, yeah, got great stuff. Yeah, uh, five nine plus whatever, sixty over, I think at least. So uh, strong signal. VK three B, uh, VI three R A. Uh, bringing it in, uh, getting it 
Selamat berjumpa, selamat berjumpa, dan terima kasih ketemunya di Bajo kemarin. 